What's going on, y'all? Rogue player here. Um, I decided to just do a walkthrough. It's a new game. Um, I already played like the first half of it, but I'm gonna do it from the beginning. Um, I'm just gonna show you guys this story mode. Millions of years ago, Shinnok, one of the elder gods, turned on his fellow deities and invaded the Earth realm. Raiden and the Elder Gods stopped Shinnok, locked him up in the Nether Realm. Others followed in Shinnok's footsteps, like Outworld's Emperor Shao Kahn, who was obsessed with conquering Earth Realm. So Raiden convinced the Elder Gods to enact the Mortal Kombat tournament as a way to even the odds, give Earth Realm a chance. For generations, Shao Kahn followed the Elder God's rules. The war moved to the arena, where he sent his toughest fighters to challenge Raiden's greatest defenders in Mortal Kombat. Two years ago, we beat him. But Shao Kahn wasn't ready to lose. He violated the rules of Mortal Kombat and invaded Earthrealm. Most of Earth's defenders, our friends, were killed, turned into evil undead warriors. Despite the odds, we stopped Shao Kahn's invasion. As punishment, the Elder Gods destroyed him. Well, that sucks. So I guess we he's thought the not long nightmare was over. A character in this game. But it turns out that Shinnok had been manipulating events. Shao Kahn's invasion, his death. All part of Shinnok's plan to escape the Nether Realm and resume his war on the Elder Gods. Nice and easy for me. Don't I always? If by always you mean not once. So looks like Johnny Cage Major? has a tattoo in the middle of his chest. That has to be Sonya Blade, because they're always together. There's Kenshi. Alright, you have the rendezvous coordinates. Far into the forest. From there we access the portal to Raiden's Sky Temple. Where there's an angry former elder god and his devils waiting for us. Gods, portals, flying demons. Blind guys with magic swords. <laughs> the world has changed. For the worse, if we do not expel Shinnok from Raiden's temple, he means to poison Earthrealm's life force, the Jinsei. And we're not gonna let that happen. Kenshi and I appreciate the Major allowing us to join you. We're happy to help kick Shinnok's bony ass back to the Netherrealm. Get over here! Mortal Kombat. Get over here! 
Come on now. Sub-Zero. Nasty. But with brother, I don't know. Set the fight scorpion, <laughs> but um, Sub Zero, I think that's the first Sub Zero that was ever introduced in Mortal, uh, Mortal Kombat. You know, it was two Sub Zero and their brothers. Yeah, I think that's probably the first Sub Zero. Then when they got killed, he got resurrected yourself, as somebody you? else. So we're about to fight the scorpion right now. <laughs> So used to games where all you have to do is press or hold back and block. Alright, thank you. Flash kick! Even though it's not. <laughs> it's not a wish to call it. Street fighter. Thank you and good night. Oh snap! Got that chunky kick going on. I hardly, I, I really block at all. More of the defensive. Oh, you can charge up the uh, kick. Oh, man. Oh, don't throw that thing at me. Oh, man. Oh, you're not gonna win. You're not gonna win. Oh, how'd you block it? Shit. Ooh, get off me. Uppercut. Oh. Only 80 coins for that? Gotta get back to the chopper. Sonia, get out of there! And supposedly the way you can tell which sub zero is which is the, the second zero has a scar on his eye. I think that's the older brother. I can't that remember, but was that's how you tell cold. the difference. Oh. 
Oh, it didn't work. Oh, this one. I just Y'all gonna make it. Oh man. Oh no, I did. guy I hate playing with uh, against the most. I wonder if the longer the target is, it gets stronger. God dang it! Green shit all in your face, bitch! Oh, shit worn mittens! Oh, that's right, I lost the person. Oh, man. Oh. Oh, everybody does get stronger. Almost got it. Oh, I got 605 for that. That's what's up. I liked it better when we fought on the same side. <coughs> you okay? We fared better than the men. Add them to the list of things Shinnok will answer for. Thank you time. and good night. Uh, I forget what his name was. It was a new name I've never heard of, I haven't heard of before. See that wolf running in the background? I was tight, never saw that before. We're gonna fix you someday. Well, I think they're getting powered by uh Quan Chi, I believe. 
The civil short. I can't remember. Well, nice seeing them again. Sonia, that's not him. That the elevator? Yes, the elevator. Sento contains the souls well, of my ancestors. I've since I've done this already. They got um, basically, Kenshi just opens up a portal. Could they hurry the hell up. While the army's like uh, holding back the people, and then cuts off to Raiden and the other dude. And they find uh, Quan Chi and Shinnok, I think. So yeah, let's skip. You don't even think of hurting her. Then, uh, what's his name? Johnny Cage, he protects, uh, what's her name? Uh, protects Sonya Blade by, uh, by jumping in front of the, the spell that Shinnok was trying to cast on her. I guess it was like he did, like, a special little green thing. Oh, man, I was up there. Let me grab you. Oh, let's kill him. Yeah. Didn't know a face could do that. Fireball thing. You really are a fallen elder god. All right, so this is where I stopped at right here. Johnny Cage, the amulet. Are those gray, gray hairs on Johnny Cage's eyebrows? So I know this is supposed to be based in the future, something like that. Johnny, did we? Yeah, we got him. Remain here. The chamber's properties will heal Sonya Blade in short order. Quan Chi and the others, they're gone. A surge of power within the chamber overwhelmed my senses. We can deal with Quan Chi later, Kinshi. We've netted a bigger prize this day. Shinnok's amulet. And within it, old Fishface himself. Let us take the amulet to the Elder Gods. They cannot destroy it. No one can. They might offer counsel. Shinnok can never escape. War is not over. Quan Chi has escaped. Why are you smiling? She called me Johnny. Oh. And? Raiden told me later oh. that I'm descended from some yeah. Mediterranean war cult, bred as warriors for the gods. I've never been able to resummon that green halo. Raiden thinks it was triggered when I saw a loved one about to die. How about you, Cassie? Can you summon anything like that? Or did it skip a generation? Take it easy, Jin. We didn't need a halo in Darfur. Or Iran. Or Kurdistan. Did we, Jackie? Nope, we didn't. Shaolin oh, monks ever send you the that, Jin? I've seen plenty of action. Takeda and I both. Stuff that blow your special forces mind. At ease. You're all here because you deserve to be. You're beautiful and unique snowflakes. 
Now, as I'm sure you're unaware, judging from the lack of gift cards, today is our team's six-week anniversary. Secretary Blake says he's pleased with our progress. You could spit in his hair and he'd be pleased with our progress. He was smart enough to have Mr. Cage put this team together. And I'm glad the Shira Ryu chose me to join. New places, new faces. Oh, you want some chocolate. As the secretary pointed out, us older folks are gonna retire someday. So it's time for your generation to step up. Shaolin Shirai Ryu SF, together. For your team's first mission, you're going to the Lin Kuei Temple. We haven't heard from the Grand Master in a while. So we need to make sure he's still on our side. That he's got our backs if things flare up again with Outworld. You need to bring him in. But don't be surprised if Sub-Zero's not willing to cooperate. Why be worried about Outworld? I thought Kotal Khan respected the Reiko Accords. He does, but he's facing a civil war. The Rebels win, those Accords will be history. 